Hey everybody, Tony Mejia here for Wager Talk with your latest ratchet play. I was under the weather last week, so we skipped it, but we'll get back uh, at it by examining the 4-9 and nine Arizona Cardinals, visiting the 3-10 and 10 Denver Broncos, which on paper looked like a pretty good matchup when the season began and people were uh, enthused about Russell Wilson and Kyler Murray, but neither may play in this game. Wilson has the best shot. He suffered a concussion on a late drive. Uh, which means we may see him, but we may not. We're taping this on Wednesday. It remains to be seen. It was a vicious hit, um, and, and it ended up uh, being a play on the uh, on the Broncos' backdoor cover against the uh, Chiefs in a 34-28 loss. Brett Rippon came on, found Jerry Judy, uh, and uh, Rippon would be in line to start against Colt McCoy here. McCoy obviously was forced into Monday night's uh, home loss to New England Three plays in after Kyler Murray tore his ACL. Uh, Arizona hung around, even led at halftime, but ultimately turnovers spoiled them. DeAndre Hopkins had a fumble that led to a scoop and score and was uh, really a game-changing play. McCoy threw a costly late interception. So both of these teams are really hurting, um, You know, basically finishing out the string since Denver has officially been eliminated from playoff contention and Arizona really lost all hope when Murray went down and, and now has to run the table and hope for help. And you know that's not happening. The Cardinals have averaged 15.7 points over their last three contests, and the Broncos are still surrendering just 18.3 points a game, despite surrendering their most points on the season against Kansas City. The Denver defense did pick off Patrick Mahomes three times and uh, has still played a large role in the team hanging around in having eight of its last nine games resulting in one score games. So they, the you know, one of those teams that hang around, give themselves a chance, and then whether it's bad play calling or, um, you know, in inconsistencies, find a way to lose. It's been a lost season in Denver. Cardinals haven't played on the road in over a month, though, and will be doing so with a backup, albeit an experienced one. Uh, so it's no surprise that the Broncos are still a two and a half to three point favorite, even with Wilson's playing status in doubt. Um, it's always tough to go to mile high if you're not used to that altitude. And uh, so, I mean, I guess I'll lean towards the Denver Broncos there, whether Wilson plays or not. Uh, Brett Rippon, uh, I, I have a little confidence in. And uh, the total is now down to 36 and a half. So we're actually going to favor the low side in the ugliest of the Sunday showdowns. If you're looking for a prop, DeAndre Hopkins receptions might be worth a play if the number isn't too high since he caught 11 balls on Monday night and will probably be the primary target for McCoy. But our official ratchet play is going to be the under 36 and a half points in Denver and Arizona for Wager Talk. I'm Tony Mejia.